This is a KGUN 9 on your side news update. Good morning, everyone. I'm Whitney Clark. The first week of the year is usually one of the busiest for Pima Animal Care Center. Each year, PAC takes in about 500 animals who run away during loud New Year's Eve celebrations. If you're missing a pet, you can call PAC to see if someone turned your pet over to them. And any pet owners who are worried about lost dogs can also check Pima County's interactive dog uh, lost dog map. It shows pictures and details of found pets, including where they were found. The link to that is on our website, kgun9.com. The National Weather Service says Southern Arizona may have seen up to two inches of snow overnight. The snow helped bring in the new year and is continuing in many places across the state. Forecasters say Cochise County could get three to six inches of snow, and in Summerhaven, at least 11 inches has already fallen. With more snow expected in the mountains and the road up to Mount Lemmon is still closed to visitors. Pima County Sheriff's officials say it's not safe to drive. Only residents and employees are allowed up. Anyone planning a trip should call the Pima County Road Hotline first. That number is 547-7510. Let's check in with April for a look outside this morning. Good morning, April. Good morning. Well, we're already seeing that wintry mix out there this morning. We're going to hold on to this through at least the late morning. You can see more snow than rain happening, and that's going to continue again through at least the late morning. Then it'll be more mixed with rain and possibly just rain after about 1 o'clock. But there it is. We've got some pretty cold temps, and we are expected to hit that freezing mark by the 8 o'clock hour. That's when we'll start seeing a little bit more clearing, possibly a little more sunshine. It's not going to be very warm today, though. We're only going to hit about 45 for the high. That 50% chance for showers, though, will continue through at least the early afternoon. And then we're going to gradually warm up as we get into Friday. We'll see 50s back tomorrow, 60s back by Friday. That's the first 60s we've seen since Christmas. And then another round of rain expected over the weekend. Whitney? Thank you, April. And as always, you can always follow us on social media throughout the day and on our apps.